What's going on guys? It's Nate Humphrey here. Today I'll be talking about like the benefits of mental health and having it, like good mental health and some tips that I found on the internet for like good mental health. So the benefits of like mental health, it gives you a sense of self-worth, dignity, belonging, self problem solving, self-determination, tolerance, acceptance and respect for others so if you have a good mental health you can kind of help with people that you may know or like friends family or people around you that might not like have people to talk to or may not be in the best mental state so that you can realize your full potential understand and feel good about yourself relate to others and expand your social support networks, experience pleasure and enjoyment, handle stress better, access challenges and problems, set goals for yourself and follow interests, explore choices and make decisions, have power and control over your life, develop good problem solving skills and coping skills and bounce back from negative experiences that you encounter um, you can with all with I know it takes a little bit for your mental health. I know it's a roller coaster It's not like You're always gonna have good mental health something could always be It could trigger something very simple like for me for example um, Something very simple sometimes can trigger trigger it like let's say someone like that you were really close with for example, my grandmother. When I see the number 111, I just think about her. I, I see that a lot, that's my lucky number. I usually see that like a lot in my daily like life. So just try to keep it. And if you need to talk to someone or like, whether it be your friend, family, counselor, therapist, coworkers, just find someone that you can talk to or do what I'm doing and talking with you guys. And if you guys have any more like tips or whatever you want to see, I'm probably going to move this channel more towards like talking about like mental health and all that stuff. So the benefits of the 10 tips for good mental health, uh, build confidence, identify your abilities and weaknesses towards uh, identify Identify your abilities and weaknesses together, accept them, build on your abilities, and do the best with what you have. Uh, two, eat right, keep fit, a balanced diet, exercise, and rest can help you to reduce stress and enjoy life. Make time for friends and families, important relationships need to be nurtured. If taken for granted, these people may not be there to share life's joys and sorrows. Give and accept support. Positive friendships, friend, no, positive friends and healthy family relationships so you sh your strength during difficult times. I know it's hard sometimes to talk about like your feelings and stuff, but um, just know that um, people are there for you no matter what, whether it be like one or two people. I only have like a few people I talk to, so um, give and accept support positive friends and healthy family relationships so their strength during the difficult time create a meaningful create a meaningful budget financial problems can cause stress overspend on your wants instead of your needs is often the culprit volunteer these are just some of the what i found this is the national canadian mental health society association so this is just theirs, this is the mine. Uh, volunteering, being involved in community gives a sense, special sense of purpose and sat satisfaction. Manage stress. We all have stress in our lives, but learning how to deal with it when it threatens to overwhelm us helps to maintain our mental health. Give, find strengths in numbers, sharing a problem with others who have, have had similar experiences may help you find a solution and will make you feel 
less isolated. So I was just pretty much just talking to people. Identify and deal with moods. We all need to find safe and constructive ways to express our feelings of anger, sadness, joy, and fear. For me, it's uh, making content for you guys, talking with you guys, and like talk. I'm getting better with this, like talking with people. So you just have to find your balance. Uh, learn to be at peace with yourself. Get to know who you are, what makes you really happy, and learn to balance what you can and cannot change about yourself. With that one, just find what makes you happy, stick with it, and if you need help, ask for help. Do everything you need to make sure you stay above float with your emotions and everything like that. I hope this video has helped a little bit. Uh, if you guys have any more comments, let me know down below. And make sure you turn your post notifications on and subscribe share with friends i will be doing a lot more of these type of videos so just let me know down below like what you want to see next or like questions or concerns or anything like that i love you guys i'll see you in the next video